أعزائي المشاهدين أهلا وسهلا بكم في حلقة جديدة من برنامجكم الوطني رواد الأعمال كما عودناكم في كل حلقة أن نستضيف نخبة من رجال الأعمال المتميزة اخترنا لكم اليوم مستر جافيد أحمد Operation Manager of Green Creation Landscaping مستر جافيد ويلكم We are glad to have you today in our show uh, We would like you to introduce yourself for our audience Thank you for coming here and taking my interview and uh, this is some special moment in my life that I am sharing with you the first time in some TV channels and uh, as of you know that I my name is uh, full name is Shakil Ahmed Muhammad Javed and I'm from India and uh, I came to UAE in 2005 before that I had worked some of the GCC countries like Saudi Arabia and Kuwait around four five years I spent there and I came to Dubai and then I feel I started my career in Dubai in 2005 and uh, when I came to Dubai I was having just 70 dirham in my pocket mm -hmm. there was no much enough money then I came to Sharjah airport and uh, from Sharjah airport when I came out I wanted to hire a taxi to go to Dubai so people are saying 100 dirham 150 dirham taxi driver so I was not having enough money to reach Dubai also so then I asked some of the people, those who are standing outside uh, in the airport, they said to me, let's do a sharing taxi and go to Dubai. So then we share a taxi and we came to Dubai and I don't know where to go in Dubai exactly. So the people said, uh, I need to go somewhere their laborers are stay staying or some Indians are staying, something like that. So they said to me, okay, let's go to place like Kalsonapur or Satwa. So I said, I, I don't know, let's go. So randomly they picked Satwa and they took me to Satwa and uh, there is a Emirates NBD bank. I first alighted there and then I look around Dubai. It's very amazing for me, it's the first experience. And then I started looking here and there. Then I was very hungry in the morning. I had a breakfast and then I was very tired because there was a night flight for me from India to Dubai. And then I was looking for some rest. I asked some of the people there, so I want some room or some space to sleep. So one of the labor said, I, we have some bed space and they said, it's 200 dirham per month. So I said, I don't have money. He said, you can pay me after one month. Then from there I started my career and then I was looking for jobs in the Gulf News and then searching here and there, here and there and I got some of the I come across with the, some ads in the Gulf News for the landscaping field and irrigation. So uh, randomly I call some of the companies and they, one of the company has chosen me and they has given me opportunity to serve them. I worked with them for one year. And uh, I started from there and Alhamdulillah keep on growing. And now I teach to this stage in around I think 15, 16 years staying in Dubai. So Alhamdulillah I'm happy and thanks to Dubai and thanks to UAE. Uh, I can make sure, I will make sure that this story will reach as much as people that are looking for, a, a, let's say, something to motivate them and to start their business or their career in Dubai. Uh, Mr. Javid, we would like to know more about the services that uh, your company provides for the customers. See, previously I uh, working in the same field uh, in Saudi Arabia and Kuwait, but whereas this uh, international standard not followed there. I worked definitely for the same field last four five years over there but I did not uh, I get a chance to learn an international environment whereas I learn in Dubai because everything whatever you see here if you go across any part of the world it is followed the same. This is one thing I observe because in my life when I come to Dubai I, I travel so many countries European countries and other many African countries and uh, other countries so I whatever we followed here the best practice followed in Dubai that I learn here and uh, working in the field see this is Dubai is a vibrant whatever business you choose you should have expertise you should have previous knowledge that is very important because that make you happy and that make you to learn and that make you to grow in the business without knowledge without anything you cannot because previous knowledge is very important in the field that will encourage you that will make you to grow in the life. So that is the things and be positive always in the life because problems and downstreams and upstreams comes in the life. Good and bad people meets in the life. 
but always positive and focus on your goal what exactly your goal is there and don't cheat and don't do any shortcut in the life because shortcut and cheating will make you spoil you know me i had a one number which i took last 15 years back from itisalat the same number i am running in my mobile i never change my mobile this is a trust you know a 15 year old client want to call me he can call and contact me and i will meet him in the same respect so this is the most important thing in the life here in dubai or in your neighbor, uh, native country or anywhere in the world you have to trust you have to gain in the market there is a first and most important strategy in the life don't cheat the people of course this is the my thing which i followed in my life and alhamdulillah at this level i reach from this success only i reach and alhamdulillah i keep growing thank you hopefully you will uh, keep growing mr javed of course here in dubai the competition is really high in many fields of the business so what makes uh, you special than others see competitors are everywhere of course yes okay in any business if you go you will find competitors okay never ever bother about the competitor mm-hmm. this is the first policy in the life if you bother about the competitor then you will be the loser yes because if you go from a selling of peanut to selling a big car there is a competitor then by keeping in this mind you will stop your business no you cannot you cannot stop your business you have to choose a right path who is my competitor and what he is doing and what best i can do and i can deliver to my client that is very important and you know in any industry if you work your clientele base your work knowledge your productivity your honesty your hygiene everything matters you know when i go to the any business there are 10 companies recently i got few projects in meadows and springs some of the area in dubai the the owner called 10 companies in front of me and i was 6 7 percent and he said me okay i said i am came on time and i need to meet you and you called me so please this is my time let me mm-hmm. how what is your scope of work then i just took his all the details and alhamdulillah he is i sent the quotation and he called all the companies and then he chose me and i got these jobs so always it happens in dubai because when you see competitor means don't be afraid don't afraid because the computer in front of you you don't know that how much he has the knowledge how much he has the practice in the field how is his productivity this all the things very important in the life of course mr javed of course you have been in the market since 2005 we need to know your vision for the next let's say 5 years see alhamdulillah my vision is very clear as the vision of the government of dubai because government of dubai is runs on the vision mm-hmm. quality so that i followed always so hopefully you will always be uh, in the top leaders let's say for uh, this field uh, of course dubai is one of the safest city in the world yes. so how can this affect you as a businessman and how can this affect the market itself see dubai is one of the safest city in the world people says mm-hmm. but i realize because saying and realization is a very different things yeah. because i born in a country where in india the situation is totally totally different and whereas in dubai situation is totally different and if you go to some other country you will realize what is dubai until unless you cannot make comparison when you meet the people or you judge the people or you travel the countries then only you can compare and then you can decide which is better and best so dubai is one of the best safest cleanest a nice city in the, in the world. world of course uh, and uae also of course they reached this level of safety and security because of the great vision as you said great vision of, of the, the leaders. leaders it goes to all leadership of course we would like uh, you to uh, to give a big thank you for the rulers of the uae and to tell us how can we reach green creation landscape landscape see first of all i really very thankful to the leaders of uae his highness president of uae and the ruler of dubai sheikh mohammed bin rashid al maktoum and crown prince of dubai i really thankful they has given a beautiful opportunity to expatriate and to grow and to learn to come up in the life 
because no other country has given this much of powers to the expatriate which i think my personally i don't know about others but what i feel my in, in general in, in prospects i'm saying i feel safest here because if you do any kind of things the solution is there of course yes you know so if you got any problem if you go ill the ambulance will be there in within a few minutes if you got any problem the police will come to help you and to rescue you within a minutes <clears throat> so everything is so balanced and organized here so that all goes to the leadership so again i really very thankful to the ruler of dubai and uh, the crown prince and the ministries and departments of the uae and government of dubai completely those who are working and those who are not working really i admire and really i am very thankful for each and every one department as well as leaders and uh, the companies those who are helping and supporting to me especially as well as all expatriate and nationals of uae okay mr javed thank you very much we need to know at the end of uh, our interview how can we reach and contact mm. your company green creation landscaping Uh, see there is a social media platform the best way to reach the company when you put on google search search engine because now nowadays any services they look they just google it yeah so just google it landscape companies in dubai or swimming pool companies in dubai or uh, outdoor living in dubai so our company will comes in top 10 because we are doing search engine optimization from google and adwords also so whenever you put any services related to outdoor living or outdoor uh, Uh, making some swimming pools landscaping or irrigation pergola gazebo whatever you want in the field just you type it so result will come and top 10 pages our name will display and click it and reach to us it's very easy and then all the detail has been given over there the email address is there mobile number is there and uh, you can learn about more our services there is a photograph gallery is there and you can directly come and reach to me my mobile number is display over there so alhamdulillah everything is there so Mr. Javid, thank you for having us today, and thank you for uh, being in our show. إلى هنا أعزائي المشاهدين هي حلقتنا الأسبوعية. تابعونا كل جمعة وسبت على قناتكم ABC Arabia. دمتم بخير وفي أمان الله. <تصفيق>